Welcome to the Handyman Pros Radio Show, home improvement and maintenance tips from the pros. Welcome to the Handyman Pros Radio Show Action Edition, where we feature an actionable tip that you can use today. And I'm here with my old buddy, Larry. Larry, hello. What I'm here. Doing? What, have, what have I been doing? Oh, you know, John, we worked on that job the other day, and this is the perfect segue for this tip, by the way. I get to the job, and John is carrying in the groceries, or at least that's what it looked like. So we get to the job. John comes walking in with these cloth grocery bags. I'm like, Johnny, it's so nice. You bought me lunch, and it's, you know, <laughs> like, this is awesome, right? But... And that's the rest of the story. John, what was in those bags? Well, you know, here here was my thing with those things. You know, I had, I carry a lot, and so do you, carry a lot of little pieces of scrap wood in, 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 your, in your truck, you know, because you're always looking for just a little piece instead of cutting a, you know, big, Yep, three quarter inch. You know the whole that whole thing. Particularly today, you know, when need... lumber prices are so high, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. And you know, there's always these little pieces, and I want to keep them. Whether they're you know some of the big PVC remnants that I have, you always could use things like that. And I was like, you know, what am I going to do with all these things? You know, they're they're taking up space and they're flying all over the place, and there's no good way to put them. And then I was like, you know what? I I look in a garage and I had some of those reusable grocery store bags that are made out of cloth or some type of material like that. Yeah. And they have a big flat bottom on it. And that's what we've been using, you know, that I can just throw a bunch of these little scraps in and it's real easy. You just open it up, you know, if you need a scrap of wood or PVC or whatever, you know, whatever you might have. And, um, you know, it's, it's easy to look for and boom, it's right there. I, I, you know, I was like, I didn't, why didn't I think of this before? So yeah. I use them also to carry like small tools. Like if I've got a bunch of tools or screws or something, I need an assortment of screws. I'll stick them in there because I've, I've got a bunch of those bags actually from a former employer, which I thought was great. And um, so I use them for the same thing. They're kind of my catch all bags, if I, especially if, I, if I've got to, you know, take stuff in because I hate running back and forth to the truck to grab. You know, Thanks. I'll bring an extra tube of caulk in one. I'll take some screws. I'll take this. I'll take that. And then into the job I go. And two, John, they also work at the grocery store. Did you know that? And they yeah, and they do work at the grocery store. I think they're I think they're uh, I think they're brilliant because you can just you know not that they're going to substitute for a uh, you know a tool bag, but you know for little things like that. Um, and also, they make great um, you know you can put a, a plastic bag inside them and use them like as a stand up garbage bag. And it's just you know, you know when you're on the job, it's great. And so, there you anyways, go. Another yeah, great you know, tip, done, right? And when you're done with them, they fold right up and you just slide them underneath the seat or, you know, you're done. Yeah, so, and they're nice and flat. They're, yeah. It's great. So, all right, folks. Well, there's another tip for you. Don't forget to join our Facebook group. We put these tips out on the Facebook group. You can join in the conversation. Leave us your tips. What tips work for you? Um, send us an email, questions at Handyman Pros Radio Show for anything at all. Even, I don't know, you know, somebody contacted me the other day trying to sell me sunglasses john can you believe that um <laughs> big surprise um also we are on twitter that's at handyman radio and we appreciate you listening oh don't forget tell all your friends and neighbors too if you like this show please pass us on let us know um, we're trying to get our listenership up and um, the best way to do it is for people to refer us so we appreciate you listening we will see you next week on the handyman pros radio show 